You're telling me, announcer. Mark, why do you think no one watches these month shows, but they all watch the other ones? Cheese. Because these ones are boring. But probably because these ones, they're not good. Cheese. Who said it like that? I didn't touch it. Mr. Anastasia isn't here to do it, and I'm sorry, but I'm just... Do you like my new shirt? I got it from this fat guy shop. What? I have a catalog. It goes really well with your hair and your glasses, and I really like it. Yeah. Well, what are we going to talk about this month, Murph? The movies to see this April. Inspire Up. Look, does that help a little bit? Oh, it actually does. <laughs> well, let's talk about what to see April 4th. And April 4th is, are we really making this? <laughs> oh, you mean, are we done yet? Yeah, you know, Ice Cube. The sequel to Are We There Yet? I actually want to see that. Actually, I think it actually but, uh, be funny. But it's just like, you know, a modern day, you know, money trouble, you know, money pit. Remember that? Yeah, but still, I mean, Ice Cube is cool. I'll see it. He's all right. What do you think his real name is? Like Pierre's or something? Maybe he's like Prince. Maybe that's his real name. Actually, may, may not. I don't know. And then is Firehouse Dog. That's that movie about that CGI dog that lives in a firehouse and does, you know, tricks and rescues people from burning fires. That kid in the movie? Yeah. Sometimes I wish he'd just not rescue them and let them burn. What? Do you really want to see people rescued or people burning on fire? Well, it depends on who they are, I mean. And the April 5th is just the reaping, that Hillary Swank movie. You know, about there's blood in the water. You know, biblical crap. Oh, that! Mm. Yeah, I'm not worried so sorry about that. <laughs> Don't spit on my show! Your show? And since April 6th is the movie that everyone's waiting for, but I'm sure they don't understand what it is. Grindhouse. Ah! And that's two movies in one. And now, those are some of you might say, watch one movie and go, Where the fuck's the raw? What's going on here? I thought it was two movies! It's like, listen. First they play fake trailers, then they play the movie, then they play fake trailers, then they play the other movie. Don't get up and leave, okay? Right? Yeah, and that would piss me off if people would not get that. <laughs> and then April 13th is Aqua Teen Hunger Force colon movie film for theaters. It sounds like they're kind of ripping off board in that title. They're, they're doing a Naka Teen Hunger Force movie? Yes, it's rated R, which we can't see it. I'm sneaking in with my friends. I want to see that. Murph, do you remember last time when we snuck in, they took notice of me because I blocked the screen? Remember? Because when you go in the top row and you walk by it, your fact can cover up the, the projector. Oh, yeah. And then they all got angry at me, and they kicked me out and banned me. Well, we should just lean on the floor. I can't go to Wilson Commons anymore. And then a movie that I already saw in a preview, Disturbia. That's a movie about that shy-ass kid who, who gets under house arrest for punching his teachers in the face, and he sees a murderer, and he's the guy from Langoliers. And he did it. I ruined the movie! Oh! Well, oh, you knew that anyway. Well, you know who I saw in that movie? Who was right next to me behind me? <coughs> John Waters. I did. Oh, yeah. He was sitting behind me. Wow. Because I live in Maryland, where he lives. Do you think we'll ever meet him? I'll ever meet him one day? No. But I did meet him. You did? He was in one of my videos. What? He was? Yes. Didn't you know? I told you. He was in Chocolate Blades. Was he the one who sent us the chocolates? You must not know any. We went to the same Serial Mom High School. That's where we go. Whatever. You must not be up on pop culture. And then this movie they keep talking about, Pathfinder. About the two wolves in a man's heart. Aren't you getting sick of hearing about that? I'm not seeing. I've seen trailers for that for two years. Are they, are they going to release that fucking movie? What's the, oh, he's like, what's the wait? I don't, there are certain movies I would wait for, but not one about wolves in a man's heart. There's one movie, well, I'll, I'll shut up about it. What? 
I don't know if we already talked about it, but there is one in particular that I'd be willing to wait forever to see. Pee Wee? Well, of course. But, uh, also, the Simpsons movie. I heard bad news. They're canceling that. What? I'm kidding. I was gonna say, if they were canceling that, then what's the point of living? And then, um, on the 20th is Hot Fuzz. That's a movie about, you, you know how sometimes when you're... Your balls get sweaty, and the pube hair gets hot. That's what it's about. Ooh, that must be an uncomfortable movie. And then the David Arquette movie, The Tripper. And Paul Rubens, a.k.a. Pee Wee, has a scene in it. Do you want to see that movie? If he's in it, then I'm already there. At, at Comic-Con, David Arquette forgot the tape. He left it in, in a jiffy. He did. And then that movie about Luke Wilson and someone else. And they go to a hotel in vacancy, and then they get filmed. Okay. And then, on April 27th, is that movie rated PG-13, The Invisible, about that boy who, who gets in some kind of a coma state, and he's dying in a well, and he has to get his girlfriend to help him. And it's... Uh, how many times they get a movie do a movie like that? I don't like the way this show went. It was dumb. I know. And, fuck. I'm crying out loud. What? We're gonna do this video again. Your hair looks awful. Again? Again? Your hair looks like shit! We've already done this! Your hair looks like shit! Don't do it like shit! With hair like that! We've already done this ten times! We're doing it again! We're not Sick of this gosh darn Congress chicken flag! Don't you do it! Don't! Uh, 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 uh. See, I, I like the wig. Oh, Rip wears the wig. He's got the fucking wig. Fuck the wig. Fuck the, fuck the fucking wig. I'm sick of hearing about this god awful wig. Don't worry, folks. I will not wear this any times later. I'll get another wig, a good wig, one with a good color, one with a good shape, one I won't get abused over. No, I remember why. It's because someone misplaced my other one, Summer of 05. That's why. God. God. Can you please put that back on? Okay. Please. And what's up with these glasses, too? I'm so sick of these, these glasses keep hurting my eyes. I've got a better pair. God, these are fucking good. There, see, these are, oh, these are much better. These ones are... Please put this back on. I'd rather not. And this shirt, I'm sick of this shirt. It's like, God, this tight. I don't, cannot remember the last time I ever took this shirt off. We're gonna get canceled now. We're not gonna canceled. We're not gonna cancel. Put back on the other wig and we're doing it again. We're not doing this again. Put back on the other wig. Murph, put on the other wig! Folks, I'm getting a new dark brown wig. I promise that we'll never see this again. Murph, this test take was not funny. We're doing it again. We're not doing it again. I'm going, on the wig on your I'm shirt. going to blend that wig on puree. Catch you next time, folks. Murph, I'm not happy about this. you got to put back on your wig. Never! Put back on!